In my workshop today, we're looking at Formula One clutches. This is a Force India clutch from 2009, one from my own collection. I actually bought this incredibly cheaply on eBay, which is surprising, bearing in mind the technology that we're about to explain that's in these. Now, the clutch is tucked away between the engine and the gearbox. As with any vehicle, the clutch disengages the engine from the gearbox. But for a Formula One car, this clutch is only ever used when starting and stopping. Most gear changes occur without the clutch ever being pulled. Yet the clutch still has to cope with a near 1,000 horsepower being passed through it as the car starts the race and at pit stops. The extreme loads enforced upon the clutch are only made worse when the engine designers want the crankshaft which the clutch is mounted to to be as low as possible. While this parameter is now regulated, there was a point where the crankshaft was just 50 millimeters from the floor of the car. Hence, we now have a tiny 97 millimeter clutch. It really is just only the size of a fist. To cope with these extreme loads in such a small space, the friction material is upgraded to carbon fiber, similar to that used in brake discs, but with a stack of four of these carbon plates creating the clamping surfaces. This carbon material copes with the loads and also the extreme temperatures, although the teams will also duct cooling air down to the clutch to prevent it overheating and slipping. When opened up, you can see the tiny dimensions of the components, which there have to be made with extreme accuracy. All this engineering leads to a clutch that incredibly weighs in at just under one kilogram. Most power units within the current engine formula run either an AP Racing or a SAX clutch. Typically, they're mounted to the back of the engine rather than sitting within the gearbox. Control of the clutch is achieved with hydraulics, with the slave cylinder pulling the clutch in and out of engagement but this must be directly related to the driver pulling the clutch paddles on the steering wheel. So there you have it, Formula One clutches, size of a fist, under one kilogram and copes with a thousand horsepower.